Hi YouTube, so in this video I'll be sharing my oldest art supplies that I got stored in this frozen box. It was kind of a hand-me-down from someone who was moving. I would say these art supplies were from up to 2003, which was the year that I started drawing actively. First up, I got my first Crayola crayon box that I have ever used. As you can see, it has this old Code Quest game that took place during 2002. Uh, you can see how used up this is. A, a very old watercolor brush. A set of watercolors that were from an old kid set. These colored pencils, as you can see how faded this is. And here I have my first colored pencils I started using. It is Sanford Colorific. You can see how how short these are now. These colorific markers, these were from 1998, though I'm certain I got these when I first started drawing, like early 2000. These old pastels from a kit from that same kid set. This charcoal stick that I never bothered using. I believe this was a gift from my aunt. So many old pencils and markers. A very old Pokemon marker. Very old highlighter. Some very old gel pens. I don't even think these work anymore. There's a feet hole punch that back when my mom was working in a craft store. Another old highlighter. A Kodak colored pencil back when I guess when this was just a camera company didn't know they had colored pencils so this the marker from that kid said I was talking about earlier some Garfield markers A very old whiteout pen. An old red ribbon pencil. Rare. Those weeks of school where they had red ribbon week. Say no to drugs. crayon from that same set. Probably my oldest art supply in here. An old Genovese crayon. You know, as far as I know, Genovese doesn't exist anymore. You know, where are those drug stores? Very old Crayola whiteboard marker may as well share these while I'm at it I got these basic or basic color pencils these are just from a dollar store not too good honestly they 
the I remember they always broke so easily. Here I got the rest of my Kodak pencils. Like I said, I forgot they even had a colored pencil brand. Here I got these uh, Flying Colors brand. I think these were hand-me-downs from my sister. Here I got the Pure Colors brand. These were also from a dollar store, I believe. Not too good either. These also broke so easily. I remember my skin tone pencil. I just could not keep it. It just always kept breaking easily. And lastly, I got... Penway Kids. Yeah, I don't know. I think these were also hand-me-downs. Well, that's it for now. Stay tuned. I'll be using most of these art supplies in my next video where I draw something old school with these things. You know, kind of like a nostalgia trip.